the serenity and slow pace. Claire, let's go. Of Hingham Drive. I'm gonna slow down just a little bit. There we go. Beautiful. Have met their match. Claire, sit. Sit. Very good. Claire, speak. Speak. Yeah, good job. This new Kent neighborhood is welcoming a new addition. Oh, she's precious. She's absolutely a delight. Who speaks her mind. Cindy and Myron Ralston Bring it here. adopted Clara three weeks ago. With our older dog, things were kind of mellow and quiet. Now, not so much. You know, <laughs> she adds a lot of excitement to, to every day. The two year old lab golden retriever mix is settling in at home. Nice. Let's go. But Clara is always ready for a road trip. Five days a week, Cindy and her sidekick set off, not to the dog park or doggy daycare. Hey, that's a good girl. Yes, ma'am. The pair has far more important tasks ahead. Hi. Would you guys like a visit from Clara? Dr. Cindy Ralston and Clara work at Sheltering Arms Institute in Goochland. Clara, up. Yeah, there we go. Clara is the rehab facility's newest oh employee goodness. and first on four legs. You can't help but look at her and feel that energy and positivity and our patients absolutely respond to that. Patients here face tall odds. Strokes and severe brain injuries are common. Whenever you're ready. A simple game of toss can cement a bond without saying a word. We're going to come over and she's going to put her head on right on your lap. Clara, visit. Yes. I think one of the other things that folks notice about Clara is her determination. We will see you again soon. We're going to take off then, okay? Bye. Sure. See ya. Dr. Ralston says her new colleague trained for nearly nine months at the nonprofit Canine Companions for Independence. So it's not just a feel-good effect. There are real demonstrable differences, real improved outcomes that can come from having a dog on your rehabilitation team. <laughs> the precocious pup's career at Sheltering Arms Institute should span a decade. That's it, that's it, that's it. Good girl, Claire, drop. So Claire can actually physically assist yeah. with some treatments, but one of the things that I have been most impressed by is her ability to just lift up the spirits and to help motivate patients. Yeah, Clara, she's been great. My patients have loved her. Oh my gosh. How you doing, Clara? Occupational therapists like Jesse Lohman see firsthand how Clara can heal on the outside and in. And as soon as she jumped up in his lap, you could just tell his face lit up. He was so happy. She has a caring, loving personality. Parnell White suffered a terrible fall weeks ago. The grandmother's recovery has been slow going. So we'll come up right beside you and you guys are gonna walk. But Miss White is making strides step by step with Clara by her side. Very nice. What makes their relationship so special? Miss White has been terrified of dogs for 30 years. Years. You forget all about that because you're in the now. In the now, it feels good and it makes you happy. Clara doesn't require a paycheck and good never job. complains. Good job, girl. However, she may so beg for the occasional nice. ear scratch or belly rub. So she just astounds me on a daily basis. The new facility dog is still learning to navigate the halls at Sheltering Arms Institute. Yes, Clara, I could take you home with me. Yes. But Clara has already found a permanent home in patients' hearts. I've never seen any dog this loving. None. None. It's just like she wants to comfort me, to love me. Did you do so good? You did so good.